Hold on, hold on, hold on. All right, what's good, y'all? Welcome back to another episode of College Kings. We're about to get lit with episode 14 today. I ain't gonna waste no time. Let's go ahead and get into it. So this is where we left off back um, running it with the wolves, going through our um, introduction or whatever, whatever. You know, we're starting to become a wolf. So, you know, we got to go through our pep talks and shit. You know what I'm saying? So we're going to go ahead and get to it. So starting off with Chris here. Determination. For this challenge, you'll have to prove that you will do whatever it takes to become a wolf. Each of you will be in separate room. You will begin. You will be given tasks to test how much you really want to be a wolf, how far you're willing to go and what you're willing to give up. Other wolves will guide you with the tasks. Let's get started. I wonder how far they're going to take us for the test. Subject guides, Marcus. Looks good, boy. So listen, I'm supposed to run you through a bunch of questions and then hit you with the final one in order to see if you're determined enough. But I'm just going to tell you straight up, the only way to show determination is if you're willing to eliminate one of the other guys. What do you mean? If I tell the guys you're willing to have me eliminated Emery oh have me el eliminate Emery I can convince them to secure you a spot you wouldn't have to compete with the others for it and if I don't then you'll still continue on with the challenges and try and secure your place but remember we all we only take in three pledges and usually at least two people take these deals and get a secure spot so you might get eliminated if you don't do it why Emery? Damn. You know why. Oh, crap. Do we eliminate Emery or do we decline that job? What? Wow. Do we really have to take out Emery, bro? Let's get him out of here, bro. Oh, I pressed the wrong thing. I pressed the wrong thing. What the hell? Okay. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to get rid of him. Let's do it. Fine, I'll do whatever it takes. You can eliminate Emery. Noted. Now we go meet Chris again. All right. So how was oh? So how was your first challenge, guys? <laughs> oh, I can see where this is going. I've got a confession to make. I know I talked about honesty before, but this challenge was actually meant to test your loyalty. I lied about the, the determination part. Oh, here we go. Here we go. What did I do, man? We wanted to see how loyal you were to your fellow pledges and potentially future wolves. Yeah, I messed up. Loyalty trumps everything. Never go against a brother's back. For those of you that did, I hope you learned a lesson. For now, let's move on to the actual determination challenge. Now this is your real determination challenge. You will need to prove that you can stick it out until the very end. How bad do you want it? How long can you suffer to get what you want? How determined are you? The task is simple. All you all of you will get into a, a tub filled with freezing cold ice water. The last one to leave wins. I've got this. I need cold water. Let's get started. Come with me. I ain't too bad, man. I ain't too bad. The boys are holding up. This, except for this, this dude. Remember, the last one is the winner. Damn. Really, bruh? Get out of here, boy. What? I'm trying to look. Oh. Hold it out, bro. What? Oh, man. Is Emery couldn't hold it? Who is this guy? At least Perry? Let's see who chickens out first. If I lose to a guy named Perry, bro, there's going to be an issue here. Yo, Jakai, why is Chloe calling you? Aw. Oh. 
Don't get out of the tub for a shorty, bruh. This could be important, but if I leave, I'll lose the challenge. No, continue the challenge. Continue the challenge. Don't be dumb, bruh. Don't be, don't be getting out because of a shorty. Get out of here with that. I'll get it later. I'm in this to win. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, come on. Get out of here, boy. Come on. We ain't losing that challenge because Chloe was calling, bro. What? Honesty. Honesty. Honesty is a key pillar to being a wolf. Without honesty, there can be no loyalty or honor. This challenge will test how honest you will really be when the time comes. The wolves will come out and say personal statements about each of you. You'll have to say whether the statements are true or false. And I will warn you, these statements are meant to embarrass you. They're meant to be shameful. First of Jackson. <coughs> true or false? <laughs> The first weekend here at the university, you got so wasted that you shit your own bed. False. Oh, shit. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm not embarrassed. I shit my pants, not my bed. Damn. Very good, Jackson. You can step back. Next up, Perry. Perry, true or false, in high school you slept with your cousin. What? Quick, true or false? What? False. Sadly, we are confident that is true. What? <laughs> Bro. Man, what reason could you possibly have for that? I didn't know she was my cousin until a lot later. Damn, you must have a big ass family. <laughs> Damn. Okay, enough fuss. Good job, Perry. Let's continue. Next up, Xavier. Xavier, true or false? You slept with your high school chemistry teacher to get an A. Well, that better be true, bruh. Yeah, damn straight. Look at this one, banging a teacher like a boss. Damn straight, bro. What the fuck? And she was in really good shape for a 65-year-old. What? Yo. That's wild. Anyway, you can step back. Emery, you're next. Oh, here we go. Emery, true or false? You've always been jealous of your older brother for being a better fighter than you. And at one point, even tried to sabotage one of his fights. What? But those times are behind me. I was a kid then. Damn. I know that's shitty of me, but I wouldn't do that to any of you ever again. Very well. Thank you for being honest. You may step back. And last, uh, last but not least, Jakai. Oh, shit. Is it true that you've never been in a fight before coming to San Villaggio? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Is it true that you've never been in a fight before coming to San Village? That's true. That's true. Shit, if I say true, I'm going to look like a weakling. But if I say false and they know I'm lying, I'll fail the challenge. You got to say true. You got to say true. You got to say true. True, true, true. It's true. No need to explain. We appreciate your honesty. You got to be honest with that shit, bro. You got to be honest with that shit. Let's move on to the next challenge. Oh, shit. Last but not least, honor. Reputation is what, is what others know about you, but honor is what you know about yourself. Each of you will be placed in a room again, only this time you won't be alone. In each room, you will be placed with someone close to the wolves. It could be a girlfriend, a sibling, or even a close friend. They will each have a... I'm not going to say that. Problem. It is your job to find the most honorable way to solve that problem you have an hour and don't come out until the hour is done wolves guide the pledges into their respective rooms i want you to good luck oh shit De oh what hey good thing i got you maybe i won't be s what
Oh shit, here we go. All right, shall we start it? Oh, here we go, man. Don't say any reason right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So my best friend knows she's going to fail her English final. She asked me if I can try and seduce her teacher to change her grade. Do I do it or not? I'm not gonna lie to you. I kind of forget what the what we're supposed to be doing here. But so her friend's gonna lose, uh, have a bad grade, unless this girl goes and seduces her teacher. Should she do that shit or not? Do it, bro. Do it. Why not? You should do it. Ah. Oh. Bro, what? Like, yeah, bro. I, like, you gotta do that junk. You gotta at least try. As your best friend, she's failing. You, she needs her. She needs your help. Do what you gotta do. Do what you gotta do. All you gotta do is go spit a little game to the teacher, and it's raps. You know what I'm saying? But the real question is, would you do it? Seduce my friend's English teacher? Hell no. Even for my best friend, that's a dumb idea. What? All right, listen. If my boy is getting a bad grade, right? And he says, yo, Jakai, go up to this teacher and spit game to her so that she can give me a better grade. If my boy said that to me to go do that to my uh, whatever teacher, I'm gonna go spit game to her. I'm gonna go spit game, boom, 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 boom. You know what I'm saying? While in the mix, I'll throw in there, you know, my boy, you know, he's failing a little bit. Talk about him a little bit. Ask if she can, you know, bump his grade up, you know, boom, 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 boom. <sighs> you know what I mean? And then, uh, you know, get busy. Get busy with the teacher, you know what I'm saying? But that's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. You got to help the boys out. What would you do? Seduce your friend's teacher. If she was hot, then maybe. Exactly. Exactly. Wow, you're totally, you're totally, what? Why not? If she was hot, I'd do it even if my friend didn't, <laughs> didn't ask me. Unbelievable. And what would you do to seduce this teacher? Tell her she's beautiful and that I like to do all kinds of things to her in the bedroom. Okay. Yeah. You did good with that beautiful part, but the rest kind of went downhill. Then in the bedroom. Uh, oh, hold on. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Was something going to pop off here? I guess you have to wait and find out. What? What? Is this not Chris's girl, man? What? Is this not Chris's girl? No, no, no. Pull away. Pull away. Pull away. It's part of the test. 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 I want to do this. I want to kiss the shorty back, but this is part of the test, and we, we can't do that. We can't because this is Chris's girl, bruh. This is Chris's girl and we're being tested right now. Don't don't be dumb. Don't be dumb. Don't be dumb. Don't be dumb. Pull away, bro. No, we can't do this. Yeah. Don't be dumb, bro. You pass damn damn straight. Damn straight. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Don't pff, the, boys, I read that like a book. I read that sitch like a book, bro. That was the real test and you passed it. Wait, really? That's great. Aaron, the test is done and he passed. Thanks, Nora. You can go now. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Then you just got a little cake there, too. Damn. Let's go back. This marks the end of pledging. We've ranked all five of you based on not only your results, but also how you got them. Doing well in the challenges is one thing, but that's not everything we considered. Let's reveal the rankings. And the first place goes to, come on, boys. Come on, boys. Amory, are you? Okay, okay. Okay, that's the homie. That's the homie. That's the homie. Loud, loud. Second place, we got to hold that. We got to hold that. Damn straight, boy. Damn straight. I'll take it. 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 It ain't first, 
But you know what? My boy Emery got it. My boy Emery got it. I fucked up in the beginning, but it's all good. I'll take second. I'll take second. Third place goes to Perry. All right, we don't give a damn. Congratulations, guys. You're officially Wolves now. You're moving in tomorrow. Let's get it, boys. Let's get it. Let's get it. Yeah, damn straight. A wolf. That's who I am now. Crazy to think. The most exciting phase of my life just about to begin. Damn. How does it feel? Unbelievable. I haven't really processed it yet. I mean, I don't even know much about frat life or fighting or... Don't say, don't say that. Don't say that. Yeah, don't worry. You're going to love it. Yeah, I think so too. All right, guys. Most of us have classes tomorrow and it's already far past midnight. Let's end it here. Amy, Perry, and Jakai, I expect you to be here with all of your things tomorrow evening. You're moving in. Applause and cheering. Yep, you know what? I'll, I'll give that up. I'll give that up. I'll give that up. We did what we had to. You know what I'm saying? We did what we had to. And guess what? We're wolves now, boys. We're wolves now. Let's get it. I completely forgot about Emily. I wonder if she's still up. Yeah. Oh, should we text Emily? Let's text her. Let's text her. Let's text her. Hey, sorry, I lost track of time. You up? Okay, is that it? We gotta wait. Yeah. I guess she's asleep. That's fine. That's fine, y'all. Today was so packed. Can't wait to just fall asleep. Okay, okay. We got a little call on the phone. Let's, you know, let's see what's popping a little bit. Message from Emily. It's okay, you'll get the surprise another time. Exciting, okay. All right, we'll leave it there. <laughs> we'll leave it there, we'll leave it there. Morning. All right, all right. Well, ladies and gents, boys and girls, you know what I'm saying? Um, We are officially wolves. We just finished all the challenges that we had to do. We did pretty good. We ranked second place out of three. Not too bad, not too bad. My boy Emery got top place, and we got some other guy taking third, which is cool. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm cool with that. But we are officially wolves. Um, and yeah, we're about to move in. And uh, and our frat life begins. You know what I'm saying? I'm excited to see whole new. This opens a whole new chapter. Whole new doors are going to be opening. You know what I'm saying? So I'm excited to see what's popping. I'm excited to see what's going to be popping off. But anyways, uh, those of you watching the stream, I hope you guys have a great night, great day. Whenever you're watching this, those of you watching on YouTube, hope you all have the same. Um, do what you got to do. But I will see you guys in the next episode. I'll be recording uh, or streaming, sorry, um, once this is up. So we'll get the videos going. But yeah, do what you got to do. I hope you guys have a great night, great day, whatever. Um, and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.